So, herzlich willkommen zurück zum neuen Part von Let's Play L.A. Noir. Wir sind hier gerade vor der Polizeistation stehen geblieben. Wir gehen jetzt rein und fragen. Ja, wohin gehst du? Ah, okay. Okay. Ah. We were on our way to interview Eli Rooney. Yes, folks, I know. This particular fiend is an old acquaintance. Ach, echt? I have tried to reaffirm his belief in a wrathful and terrible God. Whichever way it goes, I'll be dealing personally with him. Okay. You look like you've had it rough. You see me asking for your sympathy, boy? You're down on your luck, Eli. No. I have worse. My family ate roadkill during the Dust Bowl. But you have a job. A parolee has to have a job, correct? I had me a job down in San Pedro. I'm looking for something new. Uh-huh. What was I'm going to prove? That he has no job and nothing new is looking for. He's just blind, so I'm going to doubt him. Or? Yeah. Anzweifeln, das wird scheiße treuen. This place you work have a name? Hennessy Marine. You can't miss the place. Das ist, das ist kaum anzweifeln, das ist eher provozieren, das hätten sie anders nennen sollen. Sure. Green coverall. Dang thing was hot, felt like I was back in the pen wearing it. You ever tie up any of your victims, Eli? It's not a nice thing to go calling them. What would you call them? I can't say. I learned a long time ago not to go talk about the things I like. Talking about it just seems to get people's dander up. Answer the goddamn question, Rooney, before I brain you. See what I mean? Short answer is yes. You have any preference regarding rope, Eli? I know a good rope from a bad rope, if that's what you mean. That's not what you mean, is it? Ja, war das doch. Den hat man am Anfang gesehen. Okay, jetzt sagt er die Wahrheit. Er schaut dreimal wie eine Puppe. Arm boy like you, Eli, must prefer McGay for roping. Am I right? Up for braid. Tie hitching braid. Stays tight. You killed Mrs. Muller and stole her jewelry. That ain't so. Ain't done nothing like that. Äh. Anzweifeln. Er schaut blöde dran. You have no job and nowhere to live by the smell of things. And you need money. You've been in trouble before, Eli. Who do you think a jury will believe? I've been in trouble for other things, but I ain't never killed no one. I saw that car coming to the parking lot late last night. Man got changed there and put his coveralls in the trunk. I saw him drop the butterfly in the lamplight, and he strolled out, cool as you like. And I went over and I picked it up. Um. What size boot do you wear, Eli? Kind of like anything I get my hands on. I'm wearing Elevens. Welcome. Just to be a blue time. We saw Mr. Bevison. It's not your normal stiefel. Ach nein, der... Ah, provozieren. You're maybe 5'5", 5'6", tops. And you wear size 11s? I don't think so, Eli. That might be on the large side. Maybe 10s. Maybe 8s. Now that I come to think of it. Why punish children with your iniquity, Eli? You think I was never punished? You must know what you're doing is evil. Well, son. Nobody's perfect. Yo. You're as good as done, Mr. Rooney. All it will take now is some paperwork. So. Give it some money. Hugo Muller's our number one suspect. The evidence is solid. I think it's time we hit him. I need to get back to work. What do you think? My money. Hugo Muller's our number one suspect. The evidence is solid. I think it's time we hit him. Yeah, I think there is. This is where we stand, Hugo. Ich glaub nicht, dass es ist. Your next door neighbor heard screaming coming from your house. You were burning your blood-stained shoes. 
You have no one who can confirm your whereabouts last night. Your daughter says you're a violent man. We have everything we need to send you to death row. And all you have to say for yourself is, I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill him. Der ist mir viel sympathischer als der andere. Aber machen Sie keinen Lügendetektor-Test mit ihm. Why did you burn your shoes, Hugo? Because I knew you'd never believe me. Hm. Oh, ist er lieb dran. Aber wir haben keinen Beweis. Er schaut weg, aber er schaut uns auch in die Augen. Er schaut uns tief in die Augen. Na gut. Und Zweifel oder Wahrheit. Vielleicht mal Intuitionspunkt äh, einsetzen. Ja. <lacht> das bringt mich weit. Bin mir weiter. Danke. Ähm. Immer die Lüge weg. Ach, ich mach eine Minimu. Eine Minimu und raus bist du. Ja. Egal, Wahrheit. Ich hab geraten, ich hab geraten und es hat geklappt. Puh. Sammy hat, hat sich nämlich ziemlich plausibel angehört, die Erklärung. Jo. Jetzt ist er aber Lüge. Jetzt lügt er. Jetzt schaut er nicht mehr lieb dran, sondern er schaut blöd dran. Ach, haben wir Beweise? Nope. Dann machen wir anzweifeln. You learned to strangle with the rope in the army? With rope, with uh, my bare hands, but mainly with wire. I learned a lot of things in the army, but I, I still didn't kill my wife. For argument's sake. What type of rope would you use? If I had to, I would use a triple braid. Less flex, easier to control. We found your wife's car. Someone parked it at the school late last night. Do you have anything to say about that? It wasn't me. Where do you keep your work clothes? I keep them at work in my locker. Yeah. Kaum, wir haben nämlich ein Overall gefunden. Enough lies, Hugo. Your overalls put you at the scene of the crime last night. My overalls are in the laundry of my house. Ah, mach's doch. Green overalls, bloodstained, with the initials HM, found in the trunk of your wife's car. They can't be mine. Why, Hugo? Because if they were yours, they'd be in the incinerator too. Yo, Hartmut und Schlüssel. Nein, nein. Ja. Your wife was beaten with a tire iron, Hugo. An appropriate choice of tool for a mechanic. I know nothing about any tire iron. Wir haben aber einen gefunden. You're lying, Hugo. You're gonna have to come clean on this. You got no proof. Warum sagen sie das ständig? Das könnte sein. Warum sagen wir nicht gleich, was unser Beweis ist, sondern müssen erst darauf warten, dass er sagt, dass wir keine Beweise haben. Chrysler Airflow. So I guess that explains why the tire iron that killed your wife came from a Chrysler. Was machen wir jetzt? Gehen wir raus. Vielleicht haben wir ja noch ein Gespräch oder sowas. Nein. Ah, Moment. Das ist das gleiche, was du vorher gesagt hast. Das hilft mir nicht viel weiter. Das ist cool. Ah, yeah. Das ist eigentlich von innen verspiegelt. Warte mal. Ich will da nochmal reinschauen. Ja, sogar. Cool. Aber ich habe ihn am Anfang gesehen, das weiß ich ganz genau. Die gleiche Mütze, die gleiche Jacke. Ich nehme jetzt den perversen Sack. Das wollte mein Kollege eigentlich sowieso haben, auch wenn er jetzt was anderes behauptet. Wo ist der alte Sa der perverse Sack nochmal? Äh, 
Äh. Äh, wo ist denn das? Da. Nicht. Ja. Dich nehme ich, du Sack. Das war's. Ich hab's sofort gewusst. Ich habe ihn ja gesehen am Anfang. Der andere kommt mir glaubwürdiger vor. Wenn ich mich nicht mal geirrt habe. Beide hätten es sein können, aber ich habe ihn am Anfang gesehen, deswegen. Jawohl. Schlag ihn zusammen. Wichser. Ah, Phelps, Galloway. Congratulations, Herr. Stimmt's? Drink, boys. Ernsthaft? I think you'll receive a commendation for this one, gentlemen. In the meantime, I'll speak to the DA about expediting the passage of the case. We need swift and merciless justice for poor Deirdre. Wow. Super. Richtig. Geil. Ja. Sehr geil. Ist gezeichnet. Ah. Schön. Damit beende ich diesen Part von Let's Play L.A. Noir mit der richtigen Entscheidung. Wow. Tschüss.